Hello fans, good morning, welcome back to today's video. So today I will be making fish stir fry with gravy. So let's get started with the video. As you can see, I have the beef already marinated overnight. So brought it out from the fridge, add some butter in my cooking pan, then add the beef from time and continue to stir. So I'll be frying this few minutes of it. it is golden brown so next i brought out the mushroom which i already cleaned up camera so i'm going to cut them into the shape and set aside hey fans welcome back to today's video if you're new to my platform you are welcome thanks for stopping by if you haven't followed please kindly follow turn on your bell notification like and comment thank you so much so after cutting the mushroom this is the broccoli i cut them into the smaller size also i'm going to blanch it for a few minutes and uh, bring it out from the hot water rinse with chilled water so after doing that i move over to bear pepper which is red and yellow so i did that quickly and pull the broccoli from the hot water so at this point the beef is ready i pull it out from the fry pan clean the fry pan and then add some butter into the onion ginger garlic so take for a few minutes then add carrot mushroom and the rest of the gravy so at this point i'm going to allow it to steam and add my hot pepper i like adding hot pepper to my sauce so i mix to combine so at this point i'll be introducing the rest of the veggies which is broccoli into the pot mix to combine add some seasoning powder some soy sauce mix to combine also so next i went ahead with some curry space for salt and it is okay so next i'm going to introduce the fried beef into the pot mix to combine also make sure it is well mixed remember we are doing stir fry just make sure you stir very well then allow to steam not overcook So for the thickening, I'll be using cornstarch mixed with water. You can use flour, any flour of your choice, or Greek yogurt. So this is cornstarch mixed with water. So I add it into the pot, continue to mix to combine, and make sure they are well combined. So that I did, and then cover to steam for a few minutes. So guys, just check out this sauce looking so creamy and delicious so next i checked my rice it is already cooked and it's time for me to dish out my portion wow this meal is so delicious thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video bye